Here's how to create a shortcut link to any website that you can put on your iPad's home screen. This could be a lot faster than opening up the web browser and typing in a web address each time, especially if you're having students do that. What you need to do is open up your Safari app, which looks like this. Go to the specific website that you want to create a shortcut for. In this example, I'm going to use ConnectEd as our login page. So I'm just going to type in ConnectEd doing a Google search for it, and I'm going to open it up just to confirm that this is the exact page that I want to create a shortcut icon for. So this is good. I'm not going to log in. I just want to create a shortcut right to this page. So students can just tap that button every time they need to log in. Next, you want to tap the share button in the upper right hand corner. You can see it kind of pulsing there. After you hit share, at the bottom, scroll to the left or to the right, however you want to say that, and look for the Add to Home Screen option. Go ahead and tap that. You can change the name of the icon if you'd like. I'm just going to leave it called Connect Ed, but just know that you can edit that if you'd like. And then choose Add. Now you can see that that icon is on the home screen for the iPad. You can put it down on the dock. That's where I would recommend putting it, so that way no matter what page, it's always going to be available. And you'll need to do that for each iPad in your classroom. So if you want that icon on all 10 of your student iPads, you just need to do that 10 times, or you can have a student do it for you. If you're doing it on a teacher device, you'd only need to do it once. So that way, each time a student or you pick up that iPad, they can tap that, and it'll open up to this login page. And just keep in mind that if it is something that students are logging into, they will need to log out.